Dear children, today I will show you how to draw circuit diagram, electric circuit diagram. Before that, just take a look at the symbols. Whenever we represent cell, cell is the source of energy. A single cell represented by a longer line and a shorter and wider line. This is a cell, diagrammatic representation of a cell. Now a number of cells connected together to form battery. So this is the symbol of battery. Here you can see two cells are there. Right? Two cells are there. Positive terminal and negative terminal of a single cell. Positive terminal and negative terminal. Whenever cells are added to each other, always positive terminal of a cell is attached to the negative terminal of another cell. Or negative terminal of the cell is attached to the positive terminal of another cell. So a number of cells together form battery. If we want to add another cell here, just we have to add like this. Okay? Positive, negative, positive, negative, positive and negative. Wire represented by just straight line. Switch. Switch when on, then it can be represented like this or... Sometimes you can see that it is represented like this. In any book, different book shows differently. And this is off switch. Right? Off switch. In some of the book, you can see it is just shown like this. Off switch. This is a bulb and this is capital A for ammeter. Which used to measure the amount of electricity flowing through a circuit. So just take a look on these things. Ammeter we can show or cannot show in the circuit diagram. Take a look at all this. This thing we will use while drawing a circuit diagram. Now I am showing you how to draw circuit diagram. Okay. I am drawing a bulb, right? And you can understand this is a single cell. The longer line positive terminal, shorter line negative terminal. This is a switch attached to this. As symbol shows, this is a off switch. So this is an open circuit. Open circuit. So bulb is not glowing. Electricity is not flowing. Now if we want to draw a closed circuit. Again I am drawing the bulb. Like this. Right. Now I will show the cell. Wider negative terminal. Now off switch, sorry, on switch and hence the electric current is flowing through the circuit and the bulb is glowing. This is to show bulb is glowing. This is a closed circuit. Whenever electric current flows through a closed circuit, always the direction of flow is from positive terminal to negative terminal of the cell. So, with this arrow, we can show the direction of flow of electric current. This arrow will not be shown here in the open circuit. Because electricity is not flowing through it, switch is off and bulb is not glowing. Here, switch is on, bulb is glowing. And we are also showing direction of flow of electricity. So this is how simply we can draw circuit diagram. Instead of drawing every time bulb, cell and everything, we can represent this simply by this circuit diagram. I hope you all have understood. Thank you.